Alright, hello again YouTube. Okay, right. Since my last video, I've been thinking and looking and talking with some of my electronics guys and some really useful comments on the last video from everybody. We're currently drawing 490 milliamps, which is a lot less. You know, not a lot less, but it's less than what we were running before over 500 milliamps, 560 milliamps. Seems that the longer it goes, the less it seems to draw. And, you know, the manipulating the pot to get the sweet spot and all this, it's difficult. Right, anyway. So, you may notice some of the confusion I was having in the other videos about this cap. And when I was connecting it to my secondary battery to try and harvest the juice in it, it was just sharing its potential voltage with the battery so if the second if the secondary battery was at 11.76 volts as soon as you connect that cap it's just going to go to 11.76 as well so there's no way of you know harvesting the energy because it's not going to go into the battery um, so I rang up my old man who was an electrical engineer and and just like uh, one of the guys who's commented on the, the last video said stick a diode on it on the positive leg coming off the cap so let's diode this like that and then stick it to the battery and see what happens that's what I'm gonna do um, one thing is that a battery of this size tends to absorb to charge it you'd need a voltage of like you know 13 volts steady to to uh, to charge it so hopefully it will make a difference but how much difference I'm not sure I'm also you know playing with ideas about bigger better generators so you see the central tape mode here just taken out of a VCR I've got two more of them so uh, if you can see just underneath that tape motor has an axle do you see right there now if I can connect that up to more via you know literally attaching another one of these motors to the other end of that axle or by belt driving you know take take a belt out of here and spin it on the side so yeah that's that's what I'm gonna do um, I'm gonna put this diode on and see what we get um, thanks for your comments um, questions and tips we're getting closer and closer every time thanks a lot